Welcome to the second episode of this series, where we continue our journey into the secrets of the human body. For thousands of years, humanity has sought to understand the mystery of life. Where does our energy come from, and what elements sustain it? This quest stretches from the wisdom of Avicenna, through traditional Chinese medicine, and into modern science. Avicenna believed that the human body was built upon four elements, fire, air, water, and earth. These elements govern the four humors, blood, flame, yellow bile, and black bile. Health, he taught, depended on the delicate balance of these humors. When harmony was lost, disease appeared, and restoring balance was the key to healing and prevention. In the East, Chinese medicine described the body through five elements, wood, fire, earth, metal, and water. Each element was linked to an organ and a vital function, reflecting the flow of life energy, known as qi, within the human being. This ancient model emphasized harmony and interconnection across the whole body. Despite their differences, both Avicenna's medicine and Chinese medicine shared a central idea, balance. For Avicenna, it was the balance of the humors. For the Chinese, it was the balance of energy. In both views, disease was seen as the result of imbalance, and restoring harmony meant restoring health. Modern science, on the other hand, sees the human body as composed of atoms and chemical elements. More than 99% of our mass comes from just four, oxygen, carbon, hydrogen, and nitrogen, with smaller amounts of iron, calcium, and others. These tiny elements weave together a complex network that sustains life. Avicenna and Chinese medicine relied on philosophy and observation of nature, while modern science relies on experimentation and laboratories. Yet all of these paths lead to a shared truth. The human being is a network of precise balances, body and spirit united in harmony. From ancient philosophy to modern science, the journey is far from over. Each generation adds new knowledge, but the deeper truth remains. The human being is a mystery not yet fully revealed. Thank you for joining us in this second episode of the series. See you in the next journey into the secrets of the human being.